Navy veteran and baseball Hall of Famer Yogi Berra is widely known as one of the greatest catchers in the history of the game. And one museum in Passaic County is honoring his legacy. On this edition of Road Trip Close to Home, photojournalist Mike Roberts visits the Yogi Berra Museum and Learning Center in Little Falls. This is the Yogi Berra Museum and Learning Center. This museum has been here since 1998. It was founded by friends of his from the community who felt that they had this national icon living amongst us. It's not just a museum to him or baseball. Strike three, you're out. It's really that living legacy. Yogi was born Lawrence Peter Berra, raised his family in Montclair, New Jersey. That's one of the reasons why we're on the campus of Montclair State University. Yogi was a member of this community. You could see him wandering around the streets all the time. You'd see him in the King's supermarket, uh, in the barber shop. He would always stop and say hello. So this is a, a picture of Yogi playing Sandlot Ball with his pals in St. Louis. He had an incredible mind for baseball strategy. And most people would argue that the catcher is really the person seeing the entire game. The one play that everybody remembers, and I remember it too, was the play of the plate uh, in 1955, Jackie Robinson, you know, when he stole home, and Yogi swore that he was out. And I think it's fair to say that Yogi Berra was the anchor of the New York Yankees throughout their dynasty, you know, from the mid-40s. Yogi, of course, right in the center. Um, Joe Collins, Mickey Mantle, and Hank Bauer up into the early 60s. His story is one that was always very resonant and very powerful. Before he ever wore Yankee pinstripes, he enlisted in the U.S. Navy during World War II. Not only did he enlist in the Navy, but he served at D-Day, the Presidential Medal of Freedom. It is the highest civilian honor that is given in our country, and Yogi was a recipient. He grew up like a lot of us with a dream of becoming a professional athlete, and he lived that dream. Oh, he, alone in all of baseball, has 10 World Series championships with the New York Yankees. That is just an unheard of number. He didn't really think of himself as a superstar or anything special. You know, he knew he played baseball well, but he, he just wanted to it seemed to me that his goal was to be a good person. And I think what he created and what's represented here in the museum is really a testament to um, not only a person like Yogi, but to those people who really have kind of helped kind of build the country. You know, there, there are very few baseball careers that rival Yogi Berra's. Mm -hmm. 